Oh, hello there. I did not see you. Yes, it is I, Lord Tannenberg. Yes. Sadly, my old voice dies with the Uber Duck lawsuit, but A, eh, you do what you must. So today, we are going to do a refreshment of the story of plastic warfare, and yes, we have a map. In the beginning, the Greens were peaceful and happy doing, well, whatever green things are, and the Tans. Wait, that's really its name? Tanolia? Alrighty then, Tanolia attacked. The Tans pushed deep into the Greens, deep into the backyard. The Greens were caught off guard, but when some hard points held the Tans back, the 4th Green Ironclad Armoured Division tried to counter-attack and cut the Tans who overpushed. It almost worked. Almost. Till they showed up. The Great Red Union, a once small and weak nation, but with a lot of people, now came out of nowhere. Wait, they are nothing. How did the Red beat the Greens and us? Oh, oh, wow. That's messed up. And that's coming from me. The Reds, now with both Thea and the Grey's power and plastic, have pushed back the Tans and pushed the Greens to the capital city. The Red broke through the city defences and almost took the back door. Ah, not as good as me. I've done that twice now. The Greens with no other choice. Ask the Bluss here. Okay, hold the phone. Are we just making up names now? Like this story takes place after me and Sergeant Hawk, right? Like Blusher. Really? The Greens go to Blusher where they met Omega, the leader. Wait, how is Omega still alive? How? And he's blue? You can just change colors, like I get. This is short form videos and are more battle forward than story. Still, that's just bad writing. So Omega accepts and out of nowhere, the tan Major Myla shows up. Wait that traitor. I was stuck in the giant dimension for a long time, thanks to him. So the Blues and Tans have quite a battle, and the Blues push the tan traitor Myla back to his main base, where Myla reveals he came back from the dead, and it's not just him. The Greens also show up, and the battle for the base begins. Myla is nowhere to be found, but the Greens and the Blues are victorious, but at a heavy cost. Wow, well I take it back. There is some story. It looks also that the 10th Tan Warrior Armored Division is going to make a final stand as they were cut off by the Reds and Greens on Hill 228. That video, if you want to see it, will be posted in the pinned comment. All right, that's everything. Seems good so far. I asked the Lemon when he go and start back up his major projects. Sadly, he does not have the time still, but he is willing to finish the Army Men Rods project. With that, I bid you all farewell. Remember to stay safe and support the Tans. Uh, I mean like the video. Bye-bye.